Uh, I've been working on this uh, animated vi video project for the past few months, and I would like to tell you a bit about it. Also, it was the first big animation project that I was co-leading with. A, a little while ago, I started an art and animation club at my school, and um, one of the projects we did was this video. Uh, it was a climate activism video to educate um, the public on the carbon cycle, greenhouse gases, and the importance of composting in relation to this um, new law that was passed. And um, just a few logistical things that I wanted to share that might be helpful in case you're working on a project with a bunch of other animators and artists and musicians. Uh, I made a shared uh, Google Drive so we could share files really easily. I made this tracker sheet and um, some videos explaining the, the sheet and then so the storyboards as well, just so um, everyone could figure out what was going on without having to all schedule a meeting at the same time, since that proved to be d more difficult than I thought it would be. And um, I took a lot of inspiration and ideas for this uh, spreadsheet from Each Mind, which is another organization I volunteer for. So I, I just want to talk about what I did and my roles in this project. So the first step, at least for me, was revising the script and editing, making changes, making sure everything was accurate and up to date. And next, I did storyboarding. Uh, originally, I did the little thumbnails on my calendar and my planner since uh, I didn't have my tablet when I was starting this. And then I cleaned it up a little, a little bit, not really that cleaned up, but uh, I had a slideshow version. And then I talked about it with my friend and we made some changes. Uh, after we made some changes to the script and some changes to storyboards, I took uh, some notes and revised a bunch of the scenes and then we sent it off to our commissioner. The next thing I did was the background art and animation. So for the style, I have to give all the credit to uh, my co-leader for the project. He based the style off of TEDx videos, which is pretty fitting since our video is uh, very informational. It was really cool to experiment with the different paintbrushes and painting styles since I haven't really done animations that have more of a painterly look. One thing new I tried was a banana pan, and uh, I don't know if it really worked, but it's supposed to make it look like the camera angle is changing, even though it's just one image moving. The animation I did, the garbage truck was the only one I actually did frame by frame. All the other ones I used uh, Premiere Pro or After Effects to um, you do the motion of that. So for the garbage truck, it's pretty much uh, one drawing of it, and then I just uh, stretched it using the free transform tool to make it look like it's bouncing up and down and squishing and, uh, when it goes uh, stopping and stuff. And then uh, to do the, the garbage pouring out, that I pretty much, the only thing I focused on was making the shape look cool and having the volume of it consistent. So I already touched a bit on compositing uh, yep, Premiere Pro, uh, After Effects, and one thing that was really um, fun, I'm sure there's a better way to do this than just trying to eyeball it, but I made a, a parallax effect. A parallax is when the camera is moving, it looks like um, the things in the front are moving faster than the things far away. For editing, the last step I did, um, I edited a few of the scenes together especially the ones I animated, and I also I cut a few scenes and made a compact version for a social media, one minute social media video. So I hope this gave you a little insight on my process and inspired you maybe to work on your own collaborative animation projects. They're really fun and really cool to see what all the other artists come and make. <laughs> so if you'd like to see the full video, I'll link the video um, in the description. Also, feel free to contact me if you're interested in commissioning an animated video from our Art and Animation Club. Uh, thanks for watching. See you later.